What is the next perfect cupcake topping? That's what food scientists are trying to discover, and they use the scientific method to do it. Hi, my name is Catherine Cantley, and I'm a food scientist. Food science is the study of food, how it's made, its ingredients, how it acts in the human body, and how we like it or dislike it. Food scientists help create new taste combinations, develop new food products, and make our food choices healthier and safer. Anything that you see in the shelves at the grocery store or in a restaurant, someone started out with a hypothesis that they tested out to figure out how to get that perfect food. You guys excited? Yes! I am super excited too. Do you guys like science? Raise your hand if you like science. Cantley is asking the first graders in Mrs. Murrow's class at Jefferson Elementary to participate in a fun focus group. It isn't exactly how research focus groups are run, but it does give her a chance to show students how she uses the scientific method in her work. In food science, the scientific method starts with making an observation. The first observation was that kids really like goldfish crackers. Great observation. The second observation we made is that kids really like cupcakes. So we formed a hypothesis. Maybe kids would really like it if we put the goldfish on the cupcakes. And so we're gonna test that hypothesis today. What you're gonna have is you're gonna have four cupcakes, okay? And each of your cupcakes is gonna have a letter by it, A, B, C, or D, okay? When I tell you to, you're all gonna cover your eyes, not now, but when I tell you to, you're gonna cover your eyes, and Miss Joan and I, we're gonna to come to you and we're gonna put the, the plates in front of you, okay? But you're gonna still keep your eyes covered, okay? When I tell you to, we're gonna say, uncover your eyes, okay? And you're gonna see your four cupcakes and you're gonna to get to try and taste each one of them, okay? When you're tasting them, the only thing we want you to think of is, which one is my favorite one? Okay, can everybody cover your eyes? No peeking. No peeking, cover your eyes. Okay, you guys, open your eyes. Try all of them, and after you think you know which one is your favorite, write it down. Lately, we've seen a lot of salty, sweet snacks at the grocery store, and I thought there's a chance these kids might like this idea of the cracker, the salty cracker with the sweet cupcake. Okay, has everybody made their choice? Now, if your favorite cupcake was cupcake A, raise your hand. One, two, three. Okay. If your favorite cupcake was cupcake B, raise your hand. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, a lot of Bs. If your favorite cupcake was cupcake C with the goldfish, raise your hand. You guys! And if your favorite cupcake was cupcake D with the gummy bears, raise your hand. And what did Cantley learn? Well, we learned that kids may not like goldfish on their cupcakes. Maybe they like them separately, but they don't really like them on their cupcakes. That's okay. Even though our hypothesis was proven wrong, we did still learn a lot when we were doing our experiment. Most of the time, scientific experiments aren't one and done. Most of the time, you do it, you learn a little, you do another one, you learn a little more, you do another one, and you may do that for quite a while until you fin finish up with the perfect food product. So we are done with our experiment. I want to thank you guys so much for coming and helping me with our taste test. You guys can eat the rest of the cupcake if you want to, okay? I absolutely love my job. When I was looking at things I wanted to do for a job, I thought, well, I want to do something that's creative and I want to do something that's fun. And this is an area that I can use science and I can use technology, but I can also really use a lot of creativity. Um, and I really like that. If you want to learn more, head to the Science Trek website or check our related videos. And if you like Science Trek, be sure to click the subscribe button to catch our newest videos.